Hi, this is Bradley Ott. I'm a field agronomist for Pioneer Seeds in southwest Ohio. So I'm currently standing in a wheat field, uh, planted last fall, maybe a little late than normal, but as you can look behind me, uh, not a lot of green. So I'm getting a lot of questions about what's going on. It's March, it's technically spring, even though today it's about 37, it was snowing earlier. What's going on with my wheat? What can I expect? So I'll show you a few things to look at as we start moving into the warmer parts of spring to keep an eye on with your wheat fields. When we're going to scout wheat, especially for winter kill type issues or heaving or anything that may have happened uh, throughout the winter, this time of year it is imperative that you get into the field. As you can see from this video, stuff's pretty brown. But as we start to zoom in and get closer to the plants themselves, you can start seeing the green. This is important because the brown part, that's okay. Uh, the new growth is going to come from the crown, the crown being a half inch below the soil surface, preferably. And that's where all your green up and your new growth is going to come from. So it's all right if you see some of these, brain, these brown leaves out in the field. Here is a single wheat plant at the crown. You can see the base of the crown uh, towards the left side. And I split this plant in half to specifically look at what, how did it overwinter. And you can kind of see the yellow, you can see the white, uh, all the plant parts are there. This is where the new growth is going to come from uh, when it starts to warm up, the key temperature being about 50 degrees at that point. So we're not quite there yet. It's a little too early to determine on a large scale what some of this winter kill may look like, but so far we're in pretty good shape. So lastly for us, we had a pretty tough winter for wheat. It was cold. Uh, we have a lot of potholes on the roads, which means we had numerous cycles of freezing and thawing. So we will likely have some winter kill, we'll likely have some heaving, but at this time it's too difficult to see on a wide scale what that's going to look like. So we're going to continue to monitor wheat uh, as we go through the rest of March. And if we start hitting that 50 degree level, uh, especially about a half inch below the soil surface, you'll see wheat green up really quick. But for right now, it's going to be tough to decide how well it's made it through the winter. That concludes this Pioneer Growing Point Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.